It's your girl, True Jam, back, and I am coming back to unmold this bear. Um, <clears throat> I had already made one. This is the one you guys seen in my video, if you saw my video um, the other day. But because I was impatient and poured it before the black actually um, dried up, this is how it looks. So, I did not like that. It looked like that with the nose and some of that. So, I made another one. And you really cannot see just how pretty this really is. And it's chocolate. Like, so chocolatey. But it's, like, super cute. And you guys can't even see, like, the full effect of it. But, yeah, I messed up here. I poured the white too soon. So, I made another one. And I didn't look at it yet. I'm going to look at it with you guys. So let's demold it. I love silicone molds. Because they just come off so nice. Let's see. Oh, that's much better. Got a little glitter. That's much better, and it looks so soft. I mean, it feels so soft and smooth. And of course, I put glitter specks inside of there. I don't know if you guys can see it inside the white, you probably can't see it. But I um put this on there first. I did the bow, and then I did the nose and the ears first, and I let it dry for about <clears throat> till it was tacky. And I knew it wouldn't move out of place. Then I did the white. And then I put white in the back of the bow. I think you can see a little bit there. Right there. So that the color come out <clears throat> wow. much better on it. And it did. And I'm happy about that. So what I'm going to go do next is I'm going to go in and put um, white with glitter in the ears and here to finish it off like I did to this one so as you oh and put the rhinestones on the eye I put um, studs on there so I don't like that so I'm gonna put rhinestones on the eye right here and I did put a little bit of white in the chocolate on this one that's why it's not as dark um, as the other one. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it's not as dark as the other one. Because I put a little white in the chocolate to make it chocolatey. This one is a nice chocolate too. But I made some other molds that I'm going to show you guys. Um, Let's see. Oh, I make baby molds. <laughs> so I make miniature silicone babies. And um... Uh, people buy them from me and I made this crib you gotta see the crib for a miniature baby this is how small the miniature babies normally be but this is one of the cribs that I handmade and I sold all the fabric and the backing in it and I also made this mobile that I gotta make the stick for I know you guys I'm crazy and a pillow but yeah that's how the babies be in there but, um, yeah, I make a whole bunch of things. I'm going to have to show you guys some of the things. But I'm just going to demote one of these, this baby. And I've got to clean them up. Oh, look at that little face. And I made them chocolate. I'm showing this backside. And here's another mold that I didn't have it secured. So I hope everything is fine. Because it started oozing out of the bottom. So let's see, how did it come out? I don't understand why the feet are white, but okay. Now we got a big hole in the head. Look at that hole in the head. Okay, but I can feel it, I can fix it. But I think she came out perfect. Oh, I set up her hands. Like I told you guys, um, 
that epoxy resin has a lot of bubbles in it and it's hard for me to control the bubbles when it's <clears throat> when it's um <clears throat> covered and I can't put the fire to that part. But I'm gonna clean her up. She's so pretty. Look at that detail in the face. That mold is super great. And of course, I told you guys about these molds. I just filled them up because every time you have doing resin, I don't really know how to, I don't measure mine. I don't say I don't know how. I just don't measure mine. And of course, these are the molds I told you guys about where you get 19 for the $3 deal. They might be on sale again. I got mine for, I think, less than $3, but they come out perfect every time. Perfect every time. And like I told you guys, I always keep little molds on the side just in case I have an overflow and I can fill them. But I love these molds and they seem really sturdy like they're going to last long. Anytime you take your molds and you bend them and they're not white here, that is a good sign. I'm going to show you with this one. If you take your mold here and you bend it and you see white, they're not going to last long. Do you see that? It's not going to last long. But if you take it and you don't see white, they're good. <clears throat> they're going to last you for a long time. I made another flower. That's white. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then I put glitter in it. Hi, doggy. Yeah, so when you're doing resin, always keep you a, a um an extra mold around so that um Said so you can put the overflow inside. I love this little bow mold. Um, this little bow mold. I just love it. That's the bow mold. <clears throat> well, yeah, you guys. I'm so happy you guys watching all my videos and actually giving me feedback and asking me questions. It really makes my day when I come on and I see people done <laughs> asking me things and I don't mind sharing things that I've learned on the way, which I wish it was people out there that would share with me, but I'm not that kind of person. I don't mind because it's, I mean, it's a big world. I mean... You know, everybody do their things a different way. So, I like that. It's chocolate. Chocolate. And I will, all I would ask is that if somebody else needs help, just spread the word. Because, I mean, you know, I did it too late. I like the way it came out. This world is big enough for us all to share. There shouldn't be a lot of competition because normally people put their own stamp on the things that they do. A lot of people don't do them the same. You know, so you wouldn't have that to worry about. <clears throat> In these different communities. I haven't joined any community. I... Don't know why, but I just haven't. Not yet. I um don't like when people tell me what to do. So, I kind of do my own thing. I want not mind getting with some people that think like me and have the same views that I have. That would be nice. This color is not coming out. As beautiful as it is, but it's so pretty. It's like purplish with sparkles. But yeah, you guys, if you like my videos, like, share, and subscribe. Do not forget to subscribe. And I'll try to make more videos for you guys. You just 
tell me like what you want to see and I'll try to do it for you I love these bottles the way they come out and I'll try to do it and um yeah so if you like my videos like share and subscribe and you guys can have a good day look at that shine these molds get them get them 19 molds y'all that was a steal and they probably don't sell again for christmas